Here's what we need to do in order to try to fix issues with mobile data on Samsung Galaxy A36 5G. So the first thing that we can do is open settings. Next in the settings, let's go to connections. And of course, first and foremost, make sure that airplay mode is not enabled. Sometimes we turn it on by accident and this can cause the issue of mobile data not working. The next thing that is important is to go to SIM manager. We want to make sure that our SIM or eSIM is enabled. So look at the switches and turn them on in case they have been disabled. And of course, in addition to that, we also have preferred SIMs where we have the mobile data and we can choose the SIM that we want to use for mobile data. So make sure that the correct SIM is actually selected over here. Make sure that your SIM card or eSIM is still valid because, for example, I have SIM 2 that is not working anymore. I just have the physical card, but it doesn't provide me any access to the service. So if I try to switch to, for example, SIM 2, then obviously I won't have mobile data. So just in case, make sure that everything is working. I mean, your SIM card or your eSIM is still working, is still valid. There is also a chance that uh, issues with mobile data might be due to the server outage on the careers side so your service provider might have some issues um, with their servers and this is why you may have issues with mobile data however if everything seems to be fine and you still have issues with the mobile data not working properly the next thing that you can do is go back to settings and this time we're gonna scroll all the way down and we want to go to general management in general management, choose reset, and then over here we have reset mobile network settings. Usually this option does the trick, and if you have more than one SIM, then over here at the top we can choose which SIM we want to reset, so essentially you want to reset the same SIM that you use for mobile data. And then press reset settings. After that you will need to enter the password of your phone and confirm once again by pressing reset. Once you see this message that network settings have been reset, then of course we can go back to the settings and we're gonna go back to connections, SIM manager, and once again make sure that your SIM card is enabled and that the mobile data is set. Uh, to use the proper sim card that you intend to use and that is it thanks for watching leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos bye